Hey guys, what's going on? It's you, Anti. Today I want to talk about the Air Jordan Retro 7 Hair. These are set to drop Saturday for a retail price of $190. And overall, you know, the official image is released, and overall the shoe looks like it's executed perfectly. Uh, everything about it looks to be uh, on point. Uh, obviously, this is a huge, huge shoe to uh, Jordan collectors. Uh, some people argue it's the best seven out there uh, me personally my favorite seven is the Bordeaux seven uh, but a lot of people uh, will, will say this is the best seven ever you know obviously it's the first time that Jordan brand uh, you collaborated with Warner Brothers and uh, Bugs Bunny and, and Looney Tunes and everything so Jordan brand has been hitting very hard with uh, the whole Looney Tunes theme you know we obviously had the Marvin the Martians and Although they technically weren't called that, but a lot of a lot of people think that that's what they're going for. But uh, an interesting thing here, as you can see right here, Nike Air it, it is on the insole uh, on these. So that was kind of a, a surprise uh, that they did go ahead and, and remove the Jumpman and put uh, Nike Air on the insole. Also, too, like on the on the front of the tongue, people say that that green and, and orange is kind of to represent Bugs's carrot, uh, which is pretty cool as well. Um, let me know if you guys are going to pick these up, 190 too much, or is it a classic that you need? Um, for me personally, I'm, I'm on the fence. There's there's a lot releasing. Um, you know, Chicago 1's coming up. Uh, there's another, a few other sneakers uh, that I have uh, in mind too, and a pair of Sockneys I really want. Uh, so I, I'm on the fence right now. Um, definitely looking to get uh, the Bordeaux 7s too in a few months, so... Like like we like I've mentioned, the 190 is is tough. If if they were still priced around 160, I'd I'd end up buying. It, it's an easier it's an easier cop. If these are 160, I would, I'd get them no question. That extra 30, you know, is is kind of a, a big jump. So uh, I'll likely uh, hold off. However, I think it's a fantastic shoe, uh, a must have uh, for any Jordan collector. Uh, if this is going to be one of your first Jordans, like absolutely go after it. It's it'd be a good Jordan to start with if if you've never bought a Jordan or if you know you don't have many sevens in your collection. You cannot go wrong uh, with this shoe. Uh, obviously, you get 23 there uh, on the back. So uh, just a classic. I really like how they added Nike Air. The leather looks to be really nice. All the materials look to be uh, really great. So uh, let me know in the comments uh, if you're going to cop and what your favorite Jordan 7 is of all time. Uh, please hit that like button. Uh, subscribe if you're new. Check me out on Instagram and Twitter and Facebook and Snapchat. All those links are in the description. And I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Take care. Peace.